Hi everyone, this is Sharon. Welcome to another Pain in the Tech tutorial. I've had a few requests for help with animation in PowerPoint 2010. It seems that the options on the new Animations tab are causing a bit of head scratching. I've created this wee tutorial to help show you how to work with the new animation options. Here you can see I've inserted a clip art picture. I'll now add animation so that the car drives onto the slide, a text box is then displayed and the car will then drive off the slide. I like to have my animation pane visible so I'll turn this on now. First I'll add the motion path to move the car into the middle of the slide. To do this I just go to animation and then add the motion path lines. By default, the motion path will be added with a downward motion. To change this, click the Effect Options button and then select the motion direction you require. I'll now extend the finish point so that the car drives from the left of the slide and stops in the middle. Now I'll animate the text box so that it is displayed once the car is in the middle of the slide. I'll add a fade animation and then change the settings to start after previous. Now to move the car off the slide I need to select the car and then click Add Animation so that another animation is added to the picture. Once again I'll need to reset the direction and then ensure the start and stop settings are correct. Now I'll ensure this animation happens after the text box with a timing delay of around 4 seconds. Right, let's test it. I hope the answer to someone else's pain has been your gain. Thanks again for your questions and thanks for watching.